It is my one day off. Technically, I'm not really off. I have so much to do today. I have two videos to film. I have to go film for the social media account that I work for. It's my day off, but it's not really my day off. For about three weeks now, I've been starting my mornings with just water. And then later on, I'll like drink my first cup of coffee. For the first half of this year, like I felt like I wasn't drinking any water. It was either Coke Zero, Diet Coke, or coffee. And I was like, babe, you need to like, you need to take care, better care of yourself. So I got myself this um, Stanley Cup dupe from Amazon. Super cute, 26 bucks. I'm like, you best believe I'm not paying 50 bucks for a cup, okay? This does this, this does the trick and it's so cute too. Like, get into it. I've been drinking four of these a day. A bitch is hydrated, let me tell you about that. I need to do some skincare. That's the other thing that I'm really proud of myself because I've been doing my skincare like night and morning for about three weeks. If you know me in person, like I'm just someone who is not really into skincare. Like I've been blessed with beautiful skin, no acne, which I'm super grateful and blessed. I know there's so many people out there that like, they need to do skincare or else they break out and all this stuff. But like, I don't know, I've just, I think since my face has always been like this, like I get a zit or a pimple here and there, like I just feel like, I don't know, I've never had the desire to put stuff on my face. But it wasn't until recently where I was like, babe, you need to get your shit together because eventually you're gonna be 40 and you don't wanna look Haggard, you know, I've been really consistent and I am proud of myself because <laughs> Skincare has been something that I'll do like I'll get into it and like three days later I'll just like stop doing it. So Baby girl we are we are uh, We are proud of ourselves. This is what this is basically the thing that made me get into skincare Because one day I woke up I had the biggest like bags under my eyes and like I got sleep like I got good sleep that night. I don't know why, but my bags have always just been really like, really bad. The other day I showed up to work and one of my coworkers asked me if I was like, if I was good, like, she said I looked rough. So ever since then, I was like, let me invest in a little bit of skincare. Just the basics, you know? I didn't, I didn't want to do the most. I just wanted something for my eyes. The girl at Ulta sold me on the this clear one, which is niacinamide. Nice cinema. I don't know if I'm saying it wrong. She sold me on that. She was like, it minimizes pores. And I was like, bitch, I need that. Because my pores, my pores be rough. So just the minimum. Just the bare minimum. And then I just do a little, a little bit of moisturizing. A little bit of, you know, and then sunscreen. That's the other thing. I, <sighs> I was so bad with, uh, like, I never wore sunscreen. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I don't. Unless it's on my body, like if we're going to like a water park or the beach, I'll put it on my body, but like my face, like just on a regular basis to go out, like <laughs> couldn't be me. I think it's just cause I grew up like that. Like my family was never about sun, they were never about skincare. They were never about like sunscreen and stuff like that. So like I just was raised 
on not putting anything on my face. Uh, so that's just that's just the way it is. Last but not least, we're going in with the sunscreen from Trader Joe's. And the thing that is most important in my life, in my life, is obviously our Glossier. This is the rosebomb.com. Um, a lot of people have been talking about how they changed their like ingredients and the recipe and it's not as moisturizing. And after using it for like a month, I can testify that it's not as like it's not the same. Like I love the new like applicator because it's just like, you know, your regular chapstick. The recipe is different, babe. Like I feel like I'm going through this so quick and the other recipe it was like you put it on and it would last for like four hours and then you would reapply it and like it would keep your lips moisturized but this one is like it dries in like literally like 30 minutes and then you're like oh I need chopstick again you know so I don't know I don't know if I'll be getting this again I also have the wild fig which is literally my new favorite one this one is so freaking good and it leaves like a little bit of tint on your lips so like it's cute and all I'm not gonna put it on right now cuz I just put the rose on I got a late start today, which I'm not mad at. It's 9.14 already, not mad at it. I kind of planned it, because I was like, I kind of want to sleep in today. I've been feeling a little under the weather, which is a little annoying, because I have been sick, which feels like for the past three months. Like, I kid you not, like, I get sick, and then I get better. Like, two weeks later, I'm like, sick again, and then I get better, and then I'm sick again, and it's just like, what the fuck? Like, I'm honestly so annoyed, like, I, Make it make sense. Make it make sense. I'm about to start wearing a mask again because I honestly feel like my immune system is just not used to all of this, like not wearing a mask and like, it's just rough. I need to take my vitamins. Your girl has been, honestly, who am I? Like, I never used to be that girl, but, <laughs> baby girl, I'm that girl. Um, we're just, I think we're just taking better care of ourselves this year, you know? 2023 is just all about self-care, all about our bodies. The first one I like to take is probiotic for my gut because I have really bad, like, my gut health is not the very best. And honestly, if I want it to get better, I need to take some stuff. Then I like to take acidophilus, which is probiotic and calcium. And then we like to take C. Vitamin C for immune system, which I feel like it's not really doing shit because I've been getting sick. That's another reason why I started taking my vitamins because I was like, I keep getting sick and part of me thinks it's because I'm just not taking care of myself. And then we like to go with vitamin B12. And that ladies, oh my God, one of them just went in the sink. That's what I get for trying to show you guys. I can't take all of these pills like all at one time. Actually, we'll just try it. I feel like I'm gonna choke. The next one we're gonna do, my mom got me adult gummies. <laughs> it's calcium. And this is my favorite part. It's like a little treat after taking all of those, all of those vitamins. And I like to eat them individually. Like I, I need to savor each one. This is like my sweet treat. Mmm, mmm. So good, so good. Let's make coffee. <laughs> Oh, I kind of like this angle. So on this lovely day, I'm almost done with my water and then I'll start drinking my coffee. Just got some good news. I mean, good news for me because I feel like I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have a more chill day, um, but basically, the social media account that I work for, um, they ended up canceling the video shoot today, so I don't have to go to do that. Which is amazing because I have time to focus on my content. Um, like I said, I have two videos to film today, guys. I need to get my shit together, okay? Let's, let's real talk, let's talk really quick because I had a talk with one of my friends yesterday, but also my best friend slash roommate, Malaysia. We had a talk about just social media and 
how like we have like I've been on like I've been in this game for like six years now and it gets so like it gets so discouraging over time because it's like okay when is my when is it gonna be my time like obviously like it's fun to do this for fun like I love to do it but at the same time like recently you know it's just been like there's no reward like I'm having fun making the videos but at the same time it's like it like I want to be monetized like I want to like I I just want to be monetized that's basically it um but at the same time like I can't even complain like because it's all up to me like I like I haven't been putting in as much effort as I would like to like I'm not consistent I'm not posting twice a week so therefore like I'm not seeing a change and it's like I need to change I need to get my shit together and if I want this to work then I have to put a hundred percent you know like I have to I have to commit and I have to be more structured and I have to just do all the stuff like you know I and I understand it's gonna take some time and but I really do love creating videos and I I love being on YouTube like that's the only platform that I have been consistent with like I really have to like buckle down and if I want this to work it's like I gotta make it work. Also, I hate that you could see the heater right there. So ugly. But yeah, so I'm at my computer. You guys can't really see. I'm at my computer right now. And um, basically, like, my game plan is I want to come up with a posting schedule. I want to come up with video ideas. Um, I'm really loving the videos that I'm doing with like the podcast style. I really do enjoy making them and I love talking and I feel like they're fun. Um, I just need to like figure out some topics because talking is not my forte and um, I don't know. I feel like I just, I always like when I do those videos, I have to write them down. I have to like structure them or else my brain just goes all over the place. Thank you for coming to my TED talk. Um, social media is hard, man. YouTube is hard. So we're gonna work. I'm gonna plan, I'm gonna plan today's video. Maybe later we can go to like a coffee shop and like edit. Honestly, I haven't done that in forever. So I feel like that would be like a nice little refresh, a little refresher. Okay, so I have planned up my video. I'm so proud of myself. I have planned my video, so I'm gonna start filming right now while it's fresh in my head. So let's get ready. And I kind of like the setup. I feel like I don't want to mess this setup. I might just film it here at my desk. We got my microphone. I actually got this microphone on Amazon. Um, I will link it down in the description. Um, I actually made a storefront recently. I'm like, you know what? Let me let me be an actual influencer and let me list all the things that I've gotten from Amazon. A lot of people have been asking me about this microphone and Amazon. I got it for like 21 bucks, like super duper cheap. Okay, so let's set you up. I mean, honestly, we love this angle. The only thing is a stupid heater. That's my only concern, but I do like it. Recently, I've been into the whole like moving around my apartment, like to change the, the, the look. I think I'm just gonna start here and then I'm just gonna move out throughout my house. Okay, I'm gonna start filming. Honestly, proud of myself. It's 10.02. And I've gotten so much done already. Okay, we'll be right back. I'm gonna start filming. Tee -hee. Testing, testing, hi. Testing, testing. We are testing the microphone. We are positioning ourselves. We are, how, how do we like this? Maybe we should change the angle. I can, I can always go, now I, I, well, actually, I kinda, do we like this angle? I kind of do like it. Yeah, let's let's live. Let's do it. Let's live, laugh, love. So here's where we're at. So filming is done. Um, really excited about how the video turned out. Okay, I need to take that off. You guys, I've been wearing this like <laughs> all the time now. Like I feel like it really helps. I need to get a haircut. My hair is like wild. And I feel like my speaking has gotten so much better ever since I started making these like videos. Because before I used to suck. I like sit down videos, but now I feel like I'm getting better. I'm getting better. We are gonna get ready. We're gonna go edit at a coffee shop because it's been a while since I've done that and I feel like I need to get out of the house. And I also feel like I get more done when I'm 
at a coffee shop for some reason. Let's go ahead and slide her in. Take my charger. It's like when you go edit at a coffee shop, you need to be prepared because you don't know how long you're gonna be in there. You don't know what you're gonna need. You don't know if your laptop's gonna die. You don't know if your phone's gonna die. It's like, you need to be prepared. Like, I have a feeling I'm gonna be there for a couple of hours today. Um, so I need to pack my whole life in this backpack. Let's for sure do this in here. Let's do my that in here. This in here. This in here. All done. I also I hope it's <laughs> guys, I'm so I'm so I'm so proud of I'm so proud of myself. It's 1051 and I've done so much today so much the only thing I didn't get to do today is go to the gym um, I haven't gone to the gym in the past two days because I've been sick and I don't know I like every time I'm sick I'm like I do not want to go like <sighs> I just don't want to be at the gym coughing up a storm also like it just it just does not sound fun but I f I'm feeling better I'm feeling better so maybe I'll go on a walk um obviously can't forget the water okay I think we're gonna wear our little Boston's today. Let me take my socks off. I just feel like it's not the vibe. Okay, I like that more. Guys, I'm even breaking out I'm even breaking out the UV glasses like that's how serious we are. We're getting our shit together. These are such a vibe. I got. I think I got them at Target. The coffee shop is down the street from where I live so it's like, it's so nice because I could just walk um, and that's always a plus because I feel like I go on a nice little walk before I get to sit and like just, you know, vibe. Let's, let's go! I got so much done like literally I was there for like three hours and I got basically all my video done and then I had to stop because my computer died and we were sitting outside and there was like no space inside so I was like oh can't go charge my laptop so I decided to come back home and I finished my video I uploaded it worked on the thumbnail like <laughs> I have been so productive. It's already 4.39. Um, happy hour ends at 5, so I want to make it to the cute little restaurant before they end happy hour. And I do have a couple of things I need to work on. Um, I do want to work on a new channel art. Um, so I think I'm just going to sit there, eat food, maybe grab a beer, and like just like think of ideas for a new channel banner. Um, that sounds so fun. I'm starving. <laughs> 